Hi, I'm Nicole Chaplin, owner of Bella X Fitness and the author of Yes Ma'am, and you are watching Mogul Media TV. Mogul Media Television, today we have a fitness guru. Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Nicole Chaplin, owner of Bella X Fitness and author of the book, Yes Ma'am. How did you discover your passion for fitness and good health? I've always been active. I'm from Miami, Florida. My parents are Jamaican, and so I'm from a warmer climate. Always outside, track and field, was a cheerleader. Went to the University of Miami, and I just noticed every year that progressed, I was always doing something active, so it's something that came naturally. You was never overweight growing up? No, I pretty much grew like at this level, like I've been consistent my whole life. I think in my lifetime, I've probably been overweight by no more than five pounds. So I don't ever say that I'm overweight because I've pretty much been like this my whole life. What's some of the techniques you've used along your journey? One of the things that I always promote, especially whether you're inside or outside of the gym, is to do something for your spirit, whether it's prayer, whether it's meditation, whether it's being by yourself, having some alone time. That way you can focus your day and then progress into your goals and whatnot. But one of the tips is focus on your inner self first and then progress to the outside. What made you leave Miami and come to New York? I initially got my degree in marketing and my minor is music business and entertainment. And I came to New York to be in the music industry. I wanted to be the next Clive Davis. I worked at BMI and then I went to Rockefeller Records doing marketing with uh, Kanye and Damon Dash, cost marketing. And uh, when the time came when they departed, Damon and Jay, I decided to go into fitness and it just exploded. Really, really, really took off and that's why I came to New York. Different direction, went from marketing to fitness. Yes, but I used my degree from marketing to promote myself and to build my brand, Bella X Fitness, and my book, Yes Ma'am. So it works. What is Bella X Fitness? Bella X Fitness is about feeling pretty, feeling good about yourself. A Bella body is a better body. You will have a better body if you feel pretty inside. So it's all about feeling good within your soul, whether you're a man or a woman. And it's about doing stuff to the extreme, but being safe about it. If you're gonna do push-ups, do your best. Go all the way out. If you're gonna do pull-ups, do your best. Do as many as you can. So the X stands for the extremity of it. And that's why my shirt says Bella X Fitness. Yeah. In your book, Yes Ma'am, what is it about? My book is working out from the soul and then focusing on your goals. So if I'm talking about strength, I'm talking about your biceps. So I use one muscle group to represent a concept, a theory, and then or a positive principle, you could say. And that's what the entire book is about. Ten chapters, very easy read, and most people that read it really, really enjoy it. I want to ask you some scientific questions about fitness myths. Maybe you can have a hypothesis to some of them. Okay. The first one, I've been seeing more and more of these on the internet. Waist trainers look like a bustier for working out. Like, do they really work? I use them. I use them. I definitely use them. I really think it depends on what you're using it for. I use it to sweat. The, if, when I work out, if I don't sweat, I don't feel like I have a good workout. And I do notice on the days that I wear the waist trimmers, and I think that's what you're referring to, my abs seem more defined. Now, if you're at a certain weight and maybe you're not where you need to be, it might not work for you as well. But for me, I can attest and say it, ha it does work for me. So personally, from your fitness experience, waist trainers have produced results? It has, it has. I noticed definitely when I take it off, my abs are more defined than normal. And because whatever water and whatever sweat that I'm having right on the abdomen area, I'm sweating. My entire body, of course, I'm blocking my pores in a certain area, so I'm gonna sweat more, even more. And psychologically, the more I sweat, the harder I wanna go. So it kind of works like a push, like a motivator. It's helping me sweat, and now I wanna work out even harder so I can sweat more. I don't sweat easily, so it takes a lot for me to sweat, and it works for me. 